Hi everyone, my name is Nathan Connery and I'm the mayor of Frankston City and I'm with the member for Frankston, Mr. Paul Ebrook. Hey, how you going? I'm good, how are you? Pretty good. What's happening in the background here? A bit of noise, a bit of construction? Yeah, it's fantastic. Look, this is a regional level uh, facility uh, and we are finally upgrading uh, the playground. Oh, how awesome is that? So $3.45 million, uh, a co-funded project between the State Government of Victoria and Frankston Council to ensure that uh, everybody, no matter what your abilities, no matter what your age, can come to Ballon Park and enjoy it with your family. Yes, Paul, and we're going to take a walk around and check out all the areas, and we have some canine friends, is that right? We do have some canine friends from my office. We're going to give them a run over the Dog Agility Park and see what they mark it out at 10, because it's better than you or I doing it. So. It certainly is. Look, we're here at Ballon Park Athletics Track, where Council have committed $650,000. Yeah, and the track definitely needs it. Um, this facility gets a lot of use from all the schools around here doing their athletics carnivals, um, but also in really good news uh, to start in, I believe March next year, is a multi-million dollar redevelopment of the actual building over there, the pavilion, which is much needed as well. Um, it's around 30 years old, it needs some work, so state government and council have uh, come together to co-fund that great project as well. Well, I think after this pavilion is redeveloped, almost all the clubs in Ballon Park have been redeveloped. Cricket, footy, and we've got soccer over there. Look, Frankston City Council are committed to building Frankston's future, and we can't do this without Paul's help. Yeah, it's been an amazing few years. I look around Ballon Park and see what's been improved, but indeed all of Frankston. And the relationship between council and state government is as strong as ever, and that's a great thing for Frankston. We've done so much in the last couple of years, and so much more is going to be rolled out in that shared vision we have for Frankston.